Hi, IBU you learning here once again with you with some new and useful tutorials. Hope you will enjoy. Here you go. I have here Revit 2021. Now I will go to open a project, open desktop. I have a stair and railing project. I just click open. So this is the railing project. The video you can check in the description. It's already there on YouTube. So this is the railing. Now here you can see we have some floor plans, ceiling plans, 3D, some elevations also there. And if you have uh, seats in projects, so the seats will also, it will show here. Now how you can clean up all this information from your project and send your model to someone or client or your subcontractor without having all these sheets and all this information only have your model should have only 3d for the coordination purpose so doing this we have to close this project first we will use this we will go to add-ins and we will use e-transmit so once you will click e-transmit it will show you have to close your project first okay e-transmit required all Revit models to be closed so here we are going to close this first okay now here on the startup menu the startup page and here we can see we cannot find any menu for e-transmit to use this how we can get it here we will clip this click on a home tab to get this uh, uh, menu bar active and then we will go to like uh, add-ins and it is automatically uh, included in Revit 20 even uh, uh, Revit 2020, 2021 uh, it is on 2029 also uh, but uh, in the previous uh, version like uh, 2016 or uh, uh, 2017 you may maybe you cannot find so you have to download uh, some plugins but in the earlier uh, version you can find it's already coming with the Revit so here we will use this we can go to click on the transmit a model first here it's showing you have to browse the model you have to give the model location where is your model so for me model is on desktop IBU learning folder and this is the model so I select this first then we have to go to choose output directory where you can give the model output so I select the same location here there is some option you have to read and you can check or not uncheck like uh, include a related files type first two option I just keep as it is here if you need to link uh, Revit models to keep uh, any links of the models in your model uh, current model so you can check otherwise no need you have to send only 3d so you have to uncheck all these CAD links DWF markup links so you have to uncheck all now you can upgrade and clean up if your model is on uh, like a previous version so you can check this one this will give you to upgrade the model on the current mo current version of the working uh, uh, Revit so you have to check uh, clean up and then if you want to disable work set you can clip to disable the work set if you don't need work set okay you want to keep as it is so keep as it is but you can purge this is the important purge unused element model uh, inside the model like any uh, families or 3ds or uh, any um, uh, uh, any parameters if you don't need okay you are not using in the model so it will purge 
now here there is some uh, some option you have to check or uncheck now here i just did remove all sheets but include i select here views type and i go to select all it is there if you need all then you can select but here i need to just show only 3d and delete all this other information from the model so i select 3d and i now i will go to transmit this is showing save these settings for the next time if you will start e transmit for the next time for another model or another project the same current uh, setup will be there so now just let's go and start the transmit once i click it's just uh, transmitting the model it will take some time it's upon on uh, depends on the your model size okay here our model is very small so you can see here this is successfully saved the transmit e transmit done so now i'll select click okay now i will go to open and here i can see this is automatic showing the same path avu learning desktop avu learning and then here you can see this is the e transmitted model this is the original model okay what i transmit uh, used for transmission and this is the model after transmission if you'll see the file size this is suppose 6 mb 6.016 and this will be the main your main project file and after transmission it is showing that is the time of the transmission the file name is project 2020 this is the today date it's showing and the time also showing so if you will go inside the project a folder you will find this is the transmitted after transmission this file size you will see also it's reduced so this is giving after the transmission after the removal of all unwanted thing what you uncheck it is removed so let's go and open this and you see so here you can see after the transmission we will see only 3d is showing here because we only check the 3d so this model and now this model is ready to send to client to contractor or your subcontractor for their further coordination so there will be no more required sheets or anything thanks for watching please subscribe for upcoming videos thank you